Hey guys, welcome. Uh, today we're gonna do 11 exercises, 11 minutes on the floor. So get ready for some core exercises, get ready for some arm exercises, hydrate. We're gonna do real quick, maybe a couple exercises to stretch our backs, to stretch uh, our shoulders a little bit, and then uh, we'll get into our exercises. Make sure you fully stretch. Uh, take a look at the videos uh, that I have about stretching. It's, um, uh, it's called full three minute back stretcher. Highly recommended before every exercise. Okay, hydrate and we'll begin. Let's set the timer, 11 rounds, one minute each, 15 seconds in between. Oh, oh one more thing before we begin. Uh, as a couple of our uh, loyal subscribers have mentioned, if you want to change the order of the exercises that I, that I do, you're more than welcome to do so. You can uh, listen to your body, see what, what you want to do first. Uh, I have a certain method that uh, I put the exercises uh, in, in a specific order. So uh, I mix up uh, top, bottom, uh, di different sides to make sure that we get, to get into constant motion. Uh, but at the same time, don't overdo any single muscle where uh, you're going to start cramping up. But you want to get creative? Absolutely. And the second portion, uh, was somebody, uh, somebody requested and, and commented, which I think was, uh, was great, is if you have any back pain, if you have any joint pain, for instance, any kind of uh, you know, wrist pains, when we do exercises such as Russian twist, if, you, if uh, something like this hurts you, just put your arms together as a clapping motion or just have them in fists together, some, something that it doesn't hurt you. The idea is not to hurt yourself even further. If uh, certain exercises hurt your back, hurt your shoulders, you can uh, uh, write to me directly, uh, leave a comment under the video, uh, tell me what bothers you and at which point and I'll be able to suggest whether maybe stretch a little bit, maybe apply some heat or a different variation of the exercise. So stay in touch, let me know what you think and uh, what works and what doesn't work and we'll, uh, we'll make this real interactive. All right, uh, let's begin. Uh, so the first exercise are called knees side to side. You're going to lay down on your back, uh, ra raise your knees, and you're going to bring them left and right, but not touching the floor. Here we go. Starting now. On your back, arms to your sides, knees side to side. Make sure you go down, but not touching the floor. We're gonna advance to doing full leg extension with this exercise. I wanted to start with a little bit of a milder version. Got a second left. 
Okay, good. Uh, next one, mountain climbers, we're gonna do outside. The knees go outside of your elbows. twist. As I mentioned in the beginning, if your wrists hurt or your fingers, uh, arms together, fists any way you want, but for your arms to be together. Let's go. Ten seconds left. 
Keep going to the end. Good, good. Halfway there. Deep breath. Make sure you don't give up in the middle of the set if you start feeling the burn. Next one are side raisers. So, plank position as we did. Now, up and down. 30 seconds one side, 30 seconds the other. Switch. Ten seconds left. Good. If you must take a break, take two seconds and get back into it. Make sure you keep going. Next exercise is plank with hand shoulder touches. Balance is the key here. Plank, right hand touches the left shoulder. Left hand touches the right shoulder. This is how you see it from the front. As you see, as I'm uh, balancing on the right hand, I'm leaning a little bit to the right, slightly shifting the weight. Yeah, I'm not swinging, I'm just shifting the weight. Ten seconds left. All right, good. Couple more, couple more. Keep going. Now we're gonna get back to abs, leg raisers. Get on your back. Try to keep your legs as straight as you can. I suggest hands under your butt, up and down. Your heels or your, any part of your leg does not touch the floor. Ten seconds left. Excellent. Doing great. Now, we're, we're going to work on shoulders and triceps a little more. Reverse push-up. Hands shoulder width apart, behind your back. Come up, uh, raise your butt a little bit. Go up and down, just a little bit, probably the whole motion is about two to three inches. That's all we're looking for here. This is a hard exercise first few times. My suggestion is count how many repetitions you're doing before you have to stop. If you did 15 today, even if it's 10 or five, next time we do this, count again and do at least one or two more and keep building. That way you'll really see progress and mentally it'll become significantly easier. 10 seconds left.
All right, excellent. And the final exercise in today's set is scissors. And we're gonna add some arms to it, arm raisers. So scissors go like this, arms alternating. Notice the arm goes behind my head as the legs come up. Keep going, keep going, final 20 seconds. Ten seconds left. Everything you got. All right, excellent. Great job, everyone. I know you're feeling great. Let's do a couple of quick stretches. So, three deep breaths. In through your nose, out through your mouth. In through your nose, out through your mouth. And again, now, gonna get into a, a child's position. Stretch your arm as far as you can. Hold it for about five seconds. Now come up, push your lower back to the floor and head up, hold for about five seconds. Now back to this. Okay, good. Now legs in front of you. Right leg in front, left leg over. Uh, left elbow. And push on your knee. Twist your back a little bit. Okay, now switch. Okay. Uh, left arm behind your head. Pull your elbow down a little bit. Switch. Okay, good. Now, right arm in front. Switch. Okay, good. Now, feet together. With your elbows, push on your knees or below. Just a little bit, feel the tension. Hold for about five seconds, and good. Excellent. You guys did wonderful today. I know you're feeling great, a little tired, a little sweaty, but that's the idea. So, hydrate, have a glass of water, walk around a little bit, catch your breath, and come back to work out again tomorrow. I hope you enjoyed your workout. Uh, hit subscribe and share with your friends. Click on the bell button on the top to make sure you're notified of all the new videos. And thanks for working out with me. I'll see you soon.